Well, shifting to the Diamond, fresh off a program best third place finish in the conference tourney last season. PSU softball is ready to prove people wrong once again in 2018. They return some key starters mixed with fresh faces ready to battle it out in the NSIC. Pick to finish 13th in the conference this season, BSU will once again embrace the underdog role, but they're ready to prove people wrong. 13 was a uh, number in the locker for quite some time after that came out, and you know, it's, it's, we gotta prove them. Being the underdog, that's, I mean, good place to be. You get to prove everyone wrong. Uh, they don't expect you to be there. You show up, surprise them, play well, and then they're gonna start to pay attention to you. The Beavers are an even 11 and 11 heading into the conference part of the season, but are starting to hit their stride, winning four of their last five. Any games we've lost, we've learned from, they've been close. Uh, so each close game, you learn from what you did wrong, work on those mistakes, so hopefully the wins keep tallying up. And the biggest question mark coming into 2018, replacing Jess Yost in the circle, but in steps the North Dakota Gatorade Player of the Year, Steffi Doolam, who already leads the team in wins, ERA, and strikeouts. Every single time I go into the circle, it's a brand new inning, new pitch, new whatever. So uh, every single time, I just try to think about just throwing strikes, making sure that I at least get around the plate so that the people behind me can back me up. But it's no secret if the Beavers are going to build off last year's success and win games, it's the offense that needs to set the tone. We're kind of changing the focus of being a team that we would go with two to one victories or three to one victories to now saying we're going to have to score some runs. We're going to put up, you know, if we can put up five, six runs a game, we're going to be in a lot of these games. If we get our bats going and we all tally or rally them up together, it goes really well. So it just takes starting that fire and then we're going to keep hitting. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.